Hey, welcome back, Koopa Troop. As always, it's Koopa Kung Fu. In the last episode, we got over here to the dotted hole. Now, to get into this area, you're gonna have to use cut, which is kind of awkward, but it will get you through this door right here. Once you go through the door, you're welcome... Well, this is called the dotted hole, as always. You're into this little weird area. First, you're gonna fall down this hole, and then... Uh... Uh-oh. <laughs> I think, from what I read, I think it's north... West, east, then south, I think. Let's hope I'm right, or otherwise we'll be lost forever in this area. And, whew, we were right, and we find the sapphire, which is what the other gem that you need for Celio. So we're going to pick this up. All right, Coop's found a sapphire. Oh, whoa! Foo, 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 I guess right. I was right in tailing you. Haha, <laughs> it's mine. I knew that there was a sapphire here, so it belongs to me, because I found it first, clearly. I'll sell it to Team Rocket for some serious money. Woo, cash. Don't glare at me like that. If you want it back, why don't you go after it I after I sell it? I'll even tell you the one of the passwords to Team Rocket's warehouse. The warehouse password I know is yes, nah, chancy. I'm done. Don't think badly of me, even though I just stole everything from you. And then he runs much quicker than we ever could. He must have been holding the space bar or something. But so he told the other password, Golding needs logs, and yes, not Chansey. So now we have everything we need. Wow, did that one ladder just climb up like four holes worth? So we are done with this area. Um, so now after we've gotten that sapphire, or we tried to get the sapphire, we kind of failed. That uh, that scientist kind of got in the way. He's kind of a jackass. But we're going to fly back over to Four Island, and we need to, or Six Island, sorry. And now we can get out of here and go to Five Island which is where the rocket warehouse is located so that's what we're gonna head off to um, and we're working here I've never been to five islands so it's, it's gonna be fun uh, well I had rappel on before so let's see what's over there's a fisherman I don't want to fight him just yet uh, I don't want to go that way just yet I'm not sure where I want to go let's go talk to this guy hey what's up oh this stinks I want to play in the meadow but they put up a weird building on it so I can't play there oh sorry about that Five Island, Chrono Island, where time goes. I guess time, where, where time goes is the end of it, so. Uh, hey, hey. That meadow, oh, sorry, it's a different voice now. That meadow has belonged to our family for generations. I should have built a giant mansion built on it. It would have been preferable having the thugs run wild on it. Does that mean, he, the guy mean he can't get to Five Meadow Island because this building's in the way? Does he not know that you can go around on the sand down there? If he doesn't know that, maybe I should help him out, because he's kind of mentally ill. Hey, uh, house, what's this old lady doing? Are you cooking? Yeah, that's kind of cliche. Don't worry about buying anything for dinner tonight. That's what my husband said when he went off fishing today and left me. Oh. <laughs> but she's in the kitchen cooking, so get back to your place, woman. What's this guy doing? It's been getting busy around these parts lately. I haven't been catching many good fish lately either. So I guess he didn't want to battle us. That's cool. Let's go to the Pokemon trainer. Hopefully Douche isn't here. Good, he's not. Uh, not really. Okay. I w why? Um, okay. Well, this place is pretty much useless, but at least we came here and visited. So, um, hang on. Let's see. What should we be doing first? Uh... I think we want to go left. Probably. Let's let's see here. Uh, we'll go this way. We'll go this way. I don't really know exactly where we need to go. We're just gonna kind of mess around, and figure it out. Here's Water Labyrinth. Uh, oh, I forgot about Repel. That would have been smart. But there's a Hop Hip just flying over here. So if I kill it, it's gonna sink into the water and drown. So I'm not gonna be that mean. I'm gonna throw a Repel on just because we don't want to deal with Pokemon. Don't you hate that when you play a Pokemon game and Pokemon come and attack you? Oh, look at this. That was a giant rude way to go. Is this the right way? No, I can't. Why can't I ever get the right path? I'm glad I put the rappel on, otherwise I'd be screwed. There's an old man over here. You travel all over the place, don't you? You're not driving your Pokemon too harshly, are you? Yeah, dude, I, I totally whip these Pokemon into shape. I'm a beast. Let me take a look. Oh, impressive. You treat your Pokemon right. That's right, with the back of my hand. I think you can be entrusted with this. Please, I'd like you to have this. Unfortunately, you don't have space for this in your party. You come better come back for another time. Well, I think he has a Togepi egg. Um, this is an excellent environment. You mean what? This giant plot of land with nothing on it? This is a terrible place for raising Pokemon. There's nothing over here. 
What a useless trainer. Um, I'm going to set up a hypnosis on this thing, and then I'm going to set up a calm mind and attempt to sweep the, her entire team because I don't feel like trying. But uh, yeah, so apparently we need a space free to go get that Togepi egg from that guy. So that's kind of cool. I sp oh, what? First turn wake? You son of a jerk. Whatever, it doesn't really matter. I got one call mind up. Now I can just kind of psychic through the rest of this team. He's going to miss a slam, which is really funny. Um, probably should switch slam for body slam. Slam always misses when in my experience. I don't know why it is. Nope, don't want to switch. I got a call mind set up. I mean, I could switch, but it, it doesn't matter. Nah, not really. It doesn't really matter. I was not able to kill off the Clefairy. It's going to heal up with a Moonlight, but obviously another Psychic is going to finish it off, so it's got nothing doing for it. Hopefully this last Pokemon I can just finish off. So, Meryl, yeah. Oh, man, so uh, we're going to go over here, and I'm not going to get the... I mean, I'll get the egg some other time. I don't think you guys need to see that, but... I'll, you know, I'm going to pick up the egg, so we'll have the egg later. Okay, well, thank you for telling me that I can breed with Pokemon. I don't, want, I don't really want to do it. No, now we can go... Um, is, there a, is there a right? Like, can we go right now? Let's see, speed this up a little bit. Hopefully. Yeah. All right, well, we can't go right. What's north? Resort gorgeous. Ooh, this sounds sexy. Okay, well, there's po there's trainers. Let's just go battle them. Why not? Hey, what's up, chick? Hmm, the angle. It is not quite there. What is what is she talking about? What is she talking about? Painter Reyna. Have we ever fought a painter before? This might be our first one. She's going to send out a Smurgle, obviously, because it uses its tail as a paintbrush. How clever. How clever. But um, I'm not too worried about her. So, he's going to go for the double edge. It's going to do very little to no damage whatsoever. And I'm going to go for the Psychic, obviously. What what else would I go for? It's Hypno. He doesn't do anything but Psychic. Down goes her... Oh, my feelings are so blue. Whatever. The reason I'm using Penobi guys a lot is because he is a good Pokemon, but also I have the Amulet Coin on him. So, I'm getting a lot of money for everyone I battle. What's up with you? Oh, Repel War off. Okay, come back here. I am visiting my friend's retreat, if you must know, and so she wants to battle because I talked to her. I'm sorry for talking to you. She's one of these ladies um, with her old-time outfit on. I'm not really sure what she's doing at a resort with that. It's a beach resort. Why would you be wearing a full uh, clothing accessory thing? I, I don't know. Anyways, I got leech seeded, so I'm going to kill this thing off, and I'm going to switch out to my next Pokemon to get rid of the leech seed, so... In comes a skip plume. I'm not worried about this at whatsoever. <laughs> so guys, for you guys, for those who are wondering what my plan is, oh, I should use fl fly. Whatever, it doesn't matter. Um, we're gonna keep going in this area. We're gonna beat all of this. We're going to defeat the rockets once and for all. Holy crap! Twenty thousand dollars. Damn, that was nice. <laughs> wow, that was a lot of money. But um, yeah, we'll beat the rockets. Oh, what's going on here? Like a girl stare-off contest or something. Uh, okay. But we'll beat all the rockets. Once we've got the rockets beat, that um, we're going to go and catch Mewtwo. And after we catch Mewtwo, we will probably... What are we going to do after that? I'll, I'll beat the Elite Four again. I think what I'll do is I will... Is he using Dig? Oh, wow. Wasn't expecting that. Easy switch, though. We'll get Chiding in here. He'll miss the dig, and then a slash will finish him off. So, not a good plan, her part. But, yeah, we'll beat the Elite Four again. I'll look around for the rare, er, for the dog, the legendary dog. Um, I think it's... Uh, I don't remember which one it is for us. We, we, got, we got Squirtle at the start, so... I'm not sure which one it is. Uh, oh. She's thinking of having a pool made specifically for Pokemon. Why, why, why does this matter? But, uh, yeah, so this is a Mary Pits Electric. I know, but I'm still going to switch into Chiding because I don't care. So after the Elite, after Mewtwo and after the Elite Four, I think that'll probably be the end of this game. Um, there is, on Island 7, there's stuff. Well, I'll go show you guys later. Um, I will show you what's on Island 7 of this area just so you guys can see what's going on over there. So that should be pretty cool. But then after that, I mean... We'll be done. We'll be done with this game, you know. And uh, hope you guys are looking forward to the finale of this and just finishing everything up. And whew, we've been doing this LP for quite some time now, so it'd be nice for me to get it all done and completed and have another another game done. Ooh, that thunder's gonna hurt like hell. Uh, oh wow, I'm, sur sur I'm surprised our paper thin defenses 
saved us there, but whatever, she's gonna go for a full restore, I don't really care, because two slashes is gonna kill it, so, can't believe we survived that, but, uh, yeah, I mean, I am just looking forward to getting this done, like, not that I haven't had fun doing this, it's been awesome, but, uh, it's just gonna be nice getting this off our backs and totally done, and, uh, you know, just moving on to new things. So, let's see, here's the resort, oh, Selfie's house, who's, with these hands, I will create my victory! Look at all these painters. I haven't seen a single painter yet, and now there's like 50 of them just like mutating over here. I don't know what's going on. Uh, I'm gonna switch to Cross Chop. He's not really part of my team, but whatever. I guess. Go for the submission. He misses a dynamic punch, goes for a second one, hits me, and I get confused. It didn't do any damage, but confusion's gonna practically hurt more. Man, this Smurgle is beating me up, man. Up, oh, <laughs> one turn snap out of confusion. Sucks for this guy. I will destroy it with a submission, so sweet. Yeah, yep, 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 yep. You lose. Yeah, we know. Okay. Uh oh, my paint tubes have scattered everywhere. I'm so sorry to hear your loss. We're just battling all the trainers over here, cause then I mean, might as well, right? We're not doing anything. So uh, let me ask, how are you guys all doing? I guess I, I should ask a question of the day. What should be my question? My question of the day today will be, guys, um, if I was to do another Pokemon game, which I will, I promise you I will do another Pokemon game in the future, what would you guys like to see? Now, I'm kind of I'm kind of just asking this because I think I already have it planned out. I think I know what I'm going to do. But well, let me tell you my choices. I really have between Pokemon Blue, Pokemon Silver, and Pokemon Ruby. And I've, uh, I've discovered a way to film myself playing, like, these game, like, the actual Game Boy cartridges instead of an emulator, and film them in high quality. So, I, I think I'm gonna do Pokemon Ruby, and the reason is, we've already seen all of the first-gen Pokemon by doing Fire Red, so we don't really need to do Blue, it's just gonna be old graphics and kinda bad gameplay. And we haven't seen a lot of the second-gen, uh, so Silver would be maybe okay. But I don't know, I'm just kind of feeling like a Game Boy Advance game would look kind of nice and, you know, be kind of fun. So, I was kind of thinking Ruby, but I would like to get your guys' opinion on it. I'm going to dodge that guy because he was dumb. And, you know, just see what you guys think about it. And, you know, uh, hopefully, hopefully it'd be cool. I'm not, like I said, I'm not going to do it for a while. I got a lot of other games I want to LP. I'm not necessarily a Pokemon game player, though the Pokemon games are a lot of fun to me. So that's why I would be willing to do it again. Here we come to Lost Cave. And uh, let's see here. I got notes on how to get through this cave. Let me look them up right here to the start. Because uh, I know it's a really confusing cave. I'm reading up. Let's see here. So we want to go up. All right, let's see. Uh, we want to go right up down down uh, right left down right and up sweet okay how would you how would you know what to do if you didn't have these instructions but um anyways <laughs> sounds so much like rape <laughs> What do you intend to do with me? Oh, baby, you know what's gonna happen. Oh, yeah, let's get it started, uh-huh. Oh, just how I like it, nice and pretty. Oh, not really, she's gonna throw out a Persian. I have Kenobi here with, like, absolutely no moves left. But I'm gonna go for Hypnosis and Dream Eater. All right, Payday is always good. I like uh, the extra money, so I'm gonna miss the Hypnosis. That's pretty cool. Bite's gonna do a little bit more damage. Not really, this thing's... This Persian's not gonna be able to kill me at the rate it's going. Gonna get the hypnosis off, and Dream Eater will either do a kill it or do a really nice, sizable chunk. So I'm not too worried about that. Get some health back. Speed this up a little bit. All right, nice chunk to it. Hope it sleeps one more turn. Yes, it will. So Dream Eater will finish this thing off, and I will get a lot of my HP back. So that's always good. But yeah, guys, leave your uh, leave your comments obviously below where they always go, telling me what kind of game you'd like. I'm definitely leaning a lot more towards Ruby. And I think I will make the game more interesting than just doing a single type. Or, I mean, instead of just doing, like, a, let's say, you know, a random team. I'm thinking about doing something kind of different and making it kind of cool. I'm not going to tell you exactly yet, but I think I got some good ideas for it. But I want to see you guys' opinion, see what you guys are thinking. 
um, what you'd want to see. But anyways, um, finishing Pokemon, then we're jumping right back into Luigi's Mansion because I've taken a break for it for quite some time. Um, damn it! <laughs> damn it! <laughs> it woke up, but uh, so we're going to have to switch out because I'm not going to do the Hypnosis Dream or anything again. I'm going to switch, go right back into Luigi's Mansion. We're going to get that done because that actually is a very short game, and so I can get that done pretty quickly. I've just been having a hard time recording, so I will sit down and do that after Pokemon's done. After Luigi's Mansion, we will finish up Super Mario Strikers, and then we'll, we will be done with all of my ongoing Let's Plays. I'm really sorry about how they've been kind of slow. I've kind of realized that I'm not very good at doing two or three at a time. I know it gives more options for people, but, uh, you know, it, it, it's harder for me to sit down and get them... Can, consistently so maybe I'll try doing two but for now I'm gonna keep just doing one finish it off then do the next one finish it off etc I'm so glad that you happened here I grew rather bored of walking I'm feeling fatigued <laughs> may I ask you to take me home from here I don't know how I got out there because I didn't know the, the way to get out thank you you may go now no nah, bitch I'm stalking you I'm coming right in with you where did we leave off oh do I know you from somewhere oh but that doesn't matter wait I just saved your ass. Are you going to be this pompous? You're such a bitch. She wishes to see a Pokemon. A Venomoth. Okay, well, I actually do have a Venomoth, but I'm not going to show her because she's a bitch. But I think she'll give you something. I don't even know. Um, I think it's a Luxury Ball, maybe. But anyways, if we go back to this cave, and let me quickly read my notes again over here. I wrote some notes down because, guys, I, I've never done this part before, but I knew for a fact I would get extremely lost in... Oh, no! <laughs> I knew I would get extremely lost and never be able to find our way to where we need to go, so once we're done with getting these next couple of things, I will uh, save and call it quits for here, and then the next episode we will go to the Rocket Warehouse, so that should be pretty fun, and I'm not sure why I have Kenobi still out, but that's okay. We'll just switch to Kung Ku and finish this, finish this team off with a couple of EQs. Belly Drum, alright, raising the attack, nice, nice, too bad you're gonna die by my earthquake, so it didn't really matter, but it was a good try. <laughs> oh man, I, I am like pumped to get this LP done, not 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 because I hate this game, but I'm just like, it, we're ready, you know, it's been, I think it's been five months since the start of this LP, that's a long time, that's a lot longer than it normally would be, but obviously when you LP a game, as all of you know that are LPers, it takes a lot longer than normal to go through a game. Normally you could sit down and just like play a game out. When you LP you have to set everything up and record, you have to edit, you have to go to a spot and save, and you have to edit your video, and it takes a lot longer to get through a game than it would if you're just playing on your own. And so you can like, you can get bored, it's very easy to get bored because, I mean, I've been doing this Pokemon for five months, and I know you guys are probably bored of it, but I mean, I am too, like, uh, we've been doing this forever. So here, if we want lax incense, it's right, then down, it says, maybe. Yep, here it is. Alright, now we gotta go to the start of the... Okay, let's go... Oh, crap. Um... Alright, oh, crap, I didn't know he was fighting. I didn't know, <laughs> I thought he was just kind of wandering around. But um, I need to go back to the start of the cave and go the other directions to find the other items, so we'll do that. But I ran to this guy first, so whatever. Whatever, man. I will defeat, defeat you with Kung Fu. This has just been an episode of a lot of battling. I'm sorry about that. I didn't really know. You know, just going around. and uh, So we've been just doing a lot of mystery caves on like, where you need to go and everything. Both uh, Lost Cave and the Dotted Hole are both just like mine fucks. You know, they're screwing with your head, man. <laughs> Just total freaking you out, but I'm just gonna surf this entire team with uh, no real problem here, so Okay, so just as a convenient wrap-up even though we're not super close to the end of this level yet just as a quick wrap-up leave your comments in the set Damn it. I can't talk English leave your thoughts in the comments below about which game you'd like to see out of the three I mentioned silver blue or ruby. Oh, I think I also have crystal um but to be honest, I'm not sure if that if that works or not. Really, just between Blue, Silver, and Ruby. But guys, I'm really leaning heavily towards Ruby. If I did do a Ruby LP, it wouldn't be till after Luigi's Mansion, Super Mario Strikers, and after maybe one or two other games of another thing. I probably wouldn't do Ruby till uh, come this summer, which you know would be in three or four 
months. It really just depends on how many other LPs I get done and what I'm feeling. Because while this Pokemon is really fun, it just takes a while. So, you know, that's the only problem. Alright, so we're at the start again. Now, let's see here. We want to go right... Up. Down. Dodge her. Down. Right. And right. And we should be at a max revive. Sweet. That's always good. Not that I know what I'll do with that. Alright, now I need to get myself out of here. Okay. So, let's go up here. Starting for the rare candy, we're going to go right... Up, down, down, oh my gosh, right, <laughs> left, down, and left. Are, are they serious? How would you know how to do this? If you didn't have cheats like I'm doing, I'm not cheating, I'm reading a rule. I guess that's cheating. That, 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 that counts as cheating, right? Alright, so let's start from here again. We will go right, up. What? There's a wild, there's wild Pokemon in here? I did not know that. But there's a Haunter, so uh, I guess I think someone said I think that other guy said there was wild Pokemon, but whatever. Up, down, and up, and we will get to a Sea Incense. So sweet, got those two things, and now we can exit Lost Cave, and we are totally done with this area. In the next episode, we will go back and go to the Rocket Warehouse, guys. So thanks so much for tuning in. This is Koopa Kung Fu. Remember to leave your comments, and remember to like the video, guys, if you enjoyed. And I really appreciate you all tuning in and following along with this Fire Red LP, and I will see you all in the next episode. Peace.